Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I wanted to do a short mini haul. You know, there's always huge hauls, but not a whole lot of mini hauls. Or is there? Um, but let's go into what I got. Um, first thing I got was this Wet n Wild um, Mega Glow Contouring Palette. Um, contour kits in caramel toffee new formula when they came out with these like early uh, 2015 I was looking for them and I never <coughs> excuse me never found them so when I actually saw it in the store I picked it up and I've already been using this and I will say that I do like it next thing I got was um, this Milani Bella Eyes Gel Powder Eyeshadow in Emerald. It was 50% uh, off at CVS, which means that they're probably discontinuing this color. Amongst, <coughs> excuse me, amongst a other colors that were 50% off too. Then I got this blush from CoverGirl, their new line, and this is M. For medium, they had L for light, D for dark. Dark was like a mauvey color. Light was more lighter pink with a little peach in it. This is kind of in between the two. Mauvey, pinky, peach. But this is what it looks like. And it's really pretty on, on the cheeks and it's it's blend buildable. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. But that's what it looks like. And it's more like it is like a peachy pink wasn't sure if I was gonna like this but I actually do like it then I got two uh, black radiance products um, they had red stickers at um, Target so anywho this is the um, the bait bait woo, Bates blush in plum sorbet and that is what that is looking like. Kind of like a mauve, mauve color, mauve rose. It's that color right here. And then I got the Bates bronzer and caramel. And I just got this because I wanted to see how much of a highlight it would be because I knew it wasn't going to be a bronzer. But that is what it's looking like. Um, and it is really subtle. Like, I got the other one that's just a little bit darker than this. What is it called? Ginger Snap, which is the, the popular one. And that one is a better highlight for myself because I, I don't know if you'll be able to... Ooh, right here. It's very subtle. I think if you probably will be, I don't know. I don't know. It's subtle. Um, next thing I got was this um bronzer brush from Eco Tools. What and why are not what about Bed Bath and Beyond had a buy one get one free on their Eco Tools. And the real techniques brushes. Yes, I could have gone ham, but they had it around Christmas time, so I had to be mindful of money that I was spending on other people's gifts and not myself. But I got this, and I haven't been using it for bronzer, I have been using it for foundation, and I love it. Next thing I got were items from Ulta I got the Vice 4. When this bad boy went on sale and I used my little 20% coupon, yeah, <coughs> excuse me, that they tend to have um, right before Christmas. So, so ooh. there goes a, oh, that was an eyeshadow. Oh, no. Anyways, it was $39 and I used my 20% off. And I was happy that I got it for sale, even though I'm mad that that eyeshadow just fell out. But, um, because I, really I really wanted this, but it just, 
it just yeah it made me happy when it went on sale that just made me mad that my eyeshadow just fell out it was um, I don't like my stuff falling out it seemed like they don't put too much effort into gluing this stuff down but it was the color bones which is one of the colors that didn't draw me to the palette darn you darn next thing I got was something else that I was eyeing for the longest and I kept saying no I don't need it no I don't need it but then being a platinum member of Ulta for your birthday they give you I didn't know a wonderful gift so I took advantage of that gift and I got the Vegas Nay Stardust palette which I still do have in my my Ulta so I just I kept looking at this palette walking by looking at it saying to myself do I really really need it because you know Tarte has a habit not Tarte Too Faced has a habit of kind of mm, reusing similar colors but end of the day I got it and I'm so excited I made the stupid mistake by opening up the stardust thinking that it was receptor on there <laughs> and I spilled a lot of it out but it's okay I got this and I'm super super excited then <clears throat> from Ulta I got the bare minerals marvelous moxie birthday lip gloss and it's called birthday babe birthday babe and it's just a cute little pinky color with a little hint of sparkle and it's a full one so you know that's nice and I like bare minerals lip glosses all right next thing I got was this um, Hicks edge control formula um, when I wear my hair straight, I can't really put certain products on my hair because it, it will revert it to back to its curly state. So I have been looking for an edge control and I have been striking out on edge controls. I don't know why, like I don't know if it's because I put oil in my hair and, and it could be the reason, but I do. I put, I put olive oil and coconut oil in my hair, gotta moisturize it, but uh, like pure olive oil and coconut but um i tried the murray's edge control and it was a fail both the regular and the extra hold fail these like instantly when i put it on my hair it's just white gook that it's just it's gross like it's it looks like I, when i put in my hair it looks like i just slapped on some white paste on my hair that doesn't want to come out so that was a fail then I tried the what is it called um cream of nature's age control fail did the same thing I tried um olive oil's age control fail same thing um I've tried the curls paste a long time ago it didn't leave white stuff in my my hair so that was a good thing so I was going to go back to it but then when I walked in Walmart saw this <coughs> and I've seen people like talk about this so I got it this stuff is to me I felt like expensive it was $13 I seen it in um, the beauty supply store for $15 so I'm just like okay it's $13 oh and it says in God we trust <laughs> um, but you know I seen people talk about this and I've actually seen people apply it so I'm just praying that um, this works because I'm tired of Xing out on edge control because I need some because my ends are shorter you know I've had some broken up pieces so I have to lay them babies down after a while the, the curly hair start to come back and then your hair is just all over the place and yeah anyways plus my hair is ready to be washed so yeah, I needed some edge control. So all day just to say, I want to try that and that, I hope that baby works for me. Please work for me. And the last two things I got was <clears throat> this Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Moist. I'm going to be washing my hair tomorrow. I need a good conditioner 
and this seems promising. Um, I am going to mix this with other conditioners to make me a uh, homemade deep conditioner. But I got that and I got the, the shampoo. So that was it. That's my haul. It's mini. Not nothing big or grand but I thank you so much for watching the video and I will see you guys in another one stay blessed